So, you want to learn the way of the samurai, but tired of watching history and reading history books. I got you covered on this one. Yep. Well, hello there, ladies and gentlemen. It is I, Lazarus, and today I want to talk to you about the best way to learn Japanese history while having fun. Yeah, I know, it's amazing. How do you have fun and learn history? It's possible, trust me, trust me, okay? Do you trust me? Please trust me, I love you. But before we get on to that, first, I need you to smash that goddamn like button, click that subscribe and the bell. The bell is very important, you gotta admit. And not only that, follow me on Twitter, Instagram, Discord, and if you're a kind-hearted soul who wants your questions featured in my video at the end of the video, give me a few bucks on Patreon. It, it really does mean a lot. The thing that I wanted to share with you today and how you can learn Japanese history easily and effortlessly is by watching taiga dramas. So what are taiga dramas, you might be wondering? And why are you sweating so much, you might be also wondering? Because it's 35 degrees Celsius and I don't have AC, so I'm sweating a lot. You will forgive me on this one. It's just, it is what it is. So let's get back to the top. Taiga dramas are a serialized thing that's been going on since the 1950s on NHK, which is the Japanese National Broadcasting Service, right? So every year since the 1950s, they put up one series of around 50 episodes of a drama based on historical facts or some sort of person or some sort of period or whatnot. Why is this good for you? Because firstly, they're super entertaining. They, they're amazing. They're, they're awesome. They, they make them in such a good way that you're gonna be entertained while learning something historical. And it's amazing. I love it. I genuinely love it. I adore these dramas and I watch them every single day. As you know, I'm not a big fan of like the weave culture or whatnot. The, 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 I don't know, the, the anime, the mangas, the, the blushies, the toys. I, I don't do that, I don't do that. But, but, here is where I make an exception. I genuinely watch these dramas. Not because I get to learn Japanese. Trust me, you don't want to learn this Japanese. You can, you can learn it, but you're gonna be speaking like a, like a 19th century or 17th century samurai, which, let's, let's face it, might give you some uh, influence with the ladies but nobody's gonna take you seriously in japan i mean it it does sound kind of awesome to speak like a like an ancient japanese samurai and i do understand the the implications of that and you would be pretty cool it would be a pretty good party trick but don't do it please please for the love of god just don't study japanese from the taiga dramas you're gonna sound so weird it's not gonna help you in any way, shape, or form with your Japanese study, but what it will help you with is your knowledge of Japanese history. And Japanese history is amazing. You get to see what they do, and how they have their ponytails like this, and, and shave this part here. It's amazing. It's, it's so good. God damn it, I'm like Peter McKinnon right now. What's up, you boy? <laughs> so yeah, where can you find these Tiger Drums? Well, in the airing season, you can find them on NHK, actually. If you look at the previous video I made, I'm gonna put it up here. You get to see how to watch Japanese TV online. So if you go at 8 p.m. Japanese time, you will find the Taiga dramas if it's in the airing season, of course. You're, you're probably saying to me, But Lazar, there are no subtitles in there. Yes, there's no subtitles. Learn your ancient Japanese, goddammit. Why do I have to do all of the work here? <laughs> there is a way. There is a way. Firstly, you can buy it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna post a picture from Amazon how much one of my favorite series costs. So, I'm not, I'm not recommending this. You didn't hear this from me. But I'm sure you're you anime and drama and manga fans i'm sure you know certain ways to watch stuff so yeah go and buy it get it with with english subtitles and enjoy it immerse yourself in history i'm gonna give you my recommendation for what my favorite one is and it's yae no sakura which talks about this this girl who really wants to shoot guns in 19th century japan in the in the mid 19th centuries she really wants to shoot guns, nobody lets her shoot guns, and then she, they inevitably let her shoot guns, and she gets involved in, the, in this huge battle with, against 
uh, other other clans in the Shogunate. But no, what, I'm not gonna spoil it. I'll I'll leave a review of of the show next time probably. So that's my take on Tiger dramas. They're really good. You should really watch them. I, I, I shit you not, you should really watch these because the way they are made, they're not like those Viasat history dramas, right? Or history channel dramas. No, wait, what am I saying? History doesn't make, doesn't talk about history anymore. But yeah, they're really well made and they're not anime style and they're not, they're not kind of cringy with like those long ass panels like in Dragon Ball Z. God, I, I'm so annoyed with Dragon Ball Z. What? I'll, I'll leave the story for another time. I, 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 I will genuinely explain why I'm annoyed with Dragon Ball Z. You can hate me all you want, but you know I'm right. And I will talk about it next time. So, that's it for me. Uh, I hope you like this new setup. I, I, I think it's really good because the light bulb is right here. I'm genuinely touching the light bulb and breaking it. <laughs> and I hope you enjoy the way this looks and the way this sounds. This is the, the camera microphone right built in there. I don't have a better microphone. My better microphone is left back in China. Please leave a like if you enjoy, subscribe, hit the bell. Go on my Twitter where I post updates daily. Some, most of the time, multiple times a day. Go on my Instagram where I post lovely photos of Japan. And of course, if you're a kind hearted soul who wants to help me out, help out this poor Serbian beggar, give me some money on Patreon. And you get to ask a question, which I'll put in the next answer in the next video. Thank you so much everybody and I'll see you next time.